Hello everyone, welcome back to JavaScript tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to take an array and calculate the sum of an array element. So we will first take a simple array and calculate the sum of a simple array. Just after that, we will create two dimensional array and then we are going to create three dimensional array and calculate sum of an array element. But before we start this video, make sure you press the subscribe button if you haven't and press the bell icon to get notified of my every new video and also like this video if you find anything useful. So before we getting late, let's get started. So what we will do is, I will just create a simple array here. So I will just say let array is equal to and specify some elements. So I will just say here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6, right? So we have 6 element in this array, right? Just after that, I will just create another variable. So I will just say here array sum is equal to 0. Now to calculate the sum of this array element, we are going to take for each method, right? So I will just say here array, I will just select this array, right? This one and call the for each method. In this for each method, we will specify a function here. So I will just call the arrow function. So I will just specify argument. So I will just say element. So this is my first argument and then specify arrow here. So this will create a function here, right? Now I just wanted to print this array on the console. So I will just say console.log and say element here. When I execute this, you will get your array element on the console, right? Now I just wanted to calculate sum of all these array element. To do that, I will just comment here and just say here array sum is equal to array sum plus element, right? So this will calculate the sum of these array elements. So I will just say here console.log and print array sum and just execute this, right? So 21 is the sum of this array. Now just after that we are going to create 2D array. So I will just go here and I will just create a 2D array here. So I will just say let multi now we are going to create two dimensional array here so i will just create multi variable and create two dimensional array here to create two dimensional array i will just first create an array here right but let me tell you what is two dimensional array array within array is known as two dimensional array right so this is my first array in this array on zero index i will just create another array right just specify comma here on first index i will just create another array on second index i will just create another array right so array within array is known as 2d array right in the inner array i will just specify few elements so i will just say one two three and here i will just say four five six and here i will just say seven eight and nine right and i will just create a variable to calculate sum of this array so i will just say let multi sum is equal to zero now to get each element of to the array we are going to use for loop right so i will just say for let i is equal to zero i is less than multi dot length right and just after that i will say i plus plus oops right now i will just print this array on the console so i will just say console.log and say multi and specify i here right so when you execute this you will get three array here so this is my first array this is second and this is third now I just wanted to loop all this array and calculate sum of each element. So here I will just comment this statement and I will just call this simple for each method, this one. 
right i will just call this method here so i will just say multi and on i position of multi-dimensional array i will just call for each method here i will just say element this is my parameter of the function and call my function here right and i will just print this array on the console so i will just say console.log and say element here right so this is your array element right now you got your array element on the console now you can calculate the sum of this array so i will just say multi sum is equal to multi sum plus element and just say here console.log and print the multi sum variable when you execute this you will get sum of this two dimensional array right this is very simple now we are going to create three dimensional array and calculate sum of three dimensional array right so here i will just create three dimensional array so i will just select three is equal to and create a single simple array here now what is three dimensional array array within array within array is known as three dimensional array right to create three dimensional array you need to put array within array within array let me show you how to create a three dimensional array so this is my simple array i will just create array within array here so on zero index i will create an array on first index i will create an array here and on second index i will create an array right on zero index of this inner array I will just create another array here right and specify some elements so I will just say 1 2 and 3 just after that on first index of the outer array right here I will just create another array and specify some elements so I will just say 4 5 and 6 on second index of outer array right here I will just create another array and specify 7 8 and 9 right so this is my three dimensional array right just after that i will create a variable here and just say 3 th sum is equal to 0 so to calculate sum of this array we are going to use this variable just after that to calculate the sum of this array we are going to use here for loop so I will just say for let i is equal to 0, i is less than 3 dot length and i gonna be plus plus. Just after that in this for loop I will just call for each loop on each i index. So I will just say 3, specify your i variable here and call for each right. And just after that call my function here so i will just say element and call the arrow function and here i will just say console.log and print the element right so when you print your element so you will get your three array on the console now when you get your three arrays on the console we are going to iterate each array and get element on the console and then we will calculate the sum of each element so to iterate this array we have seen here right here we are using for each loop for that so we already use for each loop here to calculate this array so right now we are just comment this statement and use for loop here so i will just say for let j is equal to zero and j is less than element dot length and j plus plus right and i will just say console dot log and just print element of j so when you execute this you will get your array element on the console now when you got your array element you can calculate the sum of this array element right 
So I will just comment here and say th sum is equal to th sum plus element of j. Right? And just after that, here I will say console.log and say th sum here. Right? So when you execute this, you will get sum of three dimensional array. You can add more than three element right here. So I will just add another element here. So I will just say four, five, six, right? So you will get 60 on the console. So 60 is a sum of this three dimensional array, right? That's it. I hope you understand how to calculate sum of simple array how to calculate sum of 2d array and how to calculate the sum of 3d array i hope you understand this lecture if you find anything useful then must press the subscribe button press the bell icon to get notified of my every new video and also like this video if you find anything useful that is all for now we will see you in the next tutorial